Tuesday, October the 7th, and uh, I've decided to stop outside at Udon Thani for some breakfast. I think the roof could do with a bit of attention, but uh, anyway, let's see what they've got for breakfast. Don't fancy fish. Oh, chicken looks nice. Got no idea what they are. Well, it doesn't appear to be too much choice. I've got a whole chicken, chicken feet or chicken neck. Well, much against my better judgment, I'm going to go for the chicken feet. Right, not quite bacon and eggs, but still. There we go. middle-aged but somewhat aging uh, businessman and I use that term loosely asked me in an email what I think about when I'm cycling along and right at this very moment I'm thinking I wonder where those chicken feet had been This is one hell of a boring road. Not too sure what this place is, but very unusual. I don't think it's a garden centre. It must be an elephant supermarket. This is the outskirts of Con Cairn. Well, this is the centre of Con Khan. This is uh, nighttime Con Khan. And my uh, host, uh, Ify, Mongol Wat, who is my warm shower host, has recommended I come to this night market here for something to eat. Well, certainly plenty of choice. Well, this is dinner. It's uh, noodles with... Uh, fish and bits and pieces to go inside it I think. That last meal was so insubstantial I'm having another one in a different place. Well this doesn't look much better either. Take me back to Laos. Much better food in Laos. That was meal number two. Khon Khan is proving to be a culinary disaster. No, I don't think I can face this. <clears throat> Not quite up to Gordon Ramsay, is it, really? That's the end result. Now, this is more like it. Real food. 
Well, you can have a choice of large crickets, small crickets, flies, ants. Uh, okay. And I thought these were these were cockroaches, but they're water something. They're huge. Well, here goes. Mm. I'm not totally stupid. <laughs> 